hello friends welcome back to my channel and uh, this will be a quick video on uh, new grafana cloud okay so we have seen uh, videos on grafana like how to set up grafana on uh, normal linux machine how to set up grafana on uh, uh, docker right so i was able to see like now we have an option to get a grafana instance on cloud and which is a completely a free version as well uh, because you have two options one is a free grafana cloud version another one is a, a paid version but if you go for a free version as well you have uh, uh, features like 10,000 series for prometheus and graphic metrics it can have a 50 gp of logs it, ha it have a 14 days of re uh, retention of your metrics and the logs and uh, you can have uh, access up to three team members but if you want to go for a paid version you can go for that as well so what we will do is in this tutorial we will uh, go through the steps i will give you the link where you can go and access the grafana cloud and how to create an account and how to access it so we'll see the, those uh, features in it okay so if you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel so kindly subscribe like this video share and comment so if you go to this link okay so i will uh, have this link in the video description so you can click over there and you can access this page so if you have seen like uh, no this is published on just uh, 12th of uh, jan 2021 so just uh, five days before uh so uh, when i recorded this video is on 17th okay so uh you can see like it talks about new grafana cloud okay so uh and it's also give the complete information like there is a four hour free plan okay so which uh, i told you like what are the benefits from it and there is also a pro paid plan as well okay so if you want to go for a, a paid version you can go for that as well but in this tutorial i'll just show you how to create an account with the free version okay so now if you uh, see on the bottom side you have a you know a button for create an account so you can just uh, click on it so you will be taken into this page where you can you know uh, create an account so you can see like uh, it does not require any credit card right so give an email address uh, save your password okay then just click an account so uh, once uh, you click an account uh, it will uh, to create an account it will send you an email to your e email address where you have to verify it but you, if you see like the, the first 14 days will be a, a pro version cloud trial version okay so if you want to extend it you can do it after 14 days if not you know you can continue as a free version okay so let's create an account i will uh, enter my user id uh, email address then password then i will create an account then i will see you back there so as i said once you click on create an account you will be taken into this screen and also you'll be getting an email to confirm your account so go to your email address which you have given for registration just uh, click on confirm your uh, account okay now we need to create a project or team and then you need to give a grafana dashboard url so this url will be used to access your grafana okay so let's uh, uh, create a team and the grafana url okay okay i given the team name is uh, the tips for you and also the grafana url the tips for you dot grafana dot net then you just uh, click on uh, uh, grafana start cloud trial okay okay so i think uh, we are done so your grafana cloud stack is launching okay so now uh, what we need to do is we need to give some details you can sk skip this detail but if you, you know you can have an option to skip but if you want to select some of these uh, tools which you use so i'll use uh, grafana prometheus and i think i'll go with influx db as well okay and if you want to do something like uh, kubernetes or some linux machines uh, i will select those okay and uh, what uh, you're hoping to explore with the free, free trial i am collecting some metrics logs right i want to visualize it and probably i want to set up metrics and uh, uh, manage some prometheus okay so let's do that and let's click on done uh, okay so now you can see we are in the grafana cloud you can uh, uh, read through it or just uh, click on next okay because it's just giving a, a tutorial so you can skip the tutorial as well okay okay so now we are in the screen so 
so you see this is the team right and if you see the options we selected like i have selected grafana right and i have prometheus and there are other options like how to configure alerts uh, graphi and all those things and uh, on the left side you can see the license right and the api keys so uh, if you want to open a ticket uh, manage subscription right your plugins dashboards everything is there okay now what i want to do is i'll click on this uh, login now if you see when I click on login it has taken to me uh, this page tips for you dot grafana dot net right so if you are given a different name it will take you there okay so now just click on uh, button okay let's see so now you see like we are you know in the grafana cloud okay so now what do you want to integrate that's what it's asking so you can do this or you can just close this okay so you can always do this uh, later point as well so if you see like uh, we are in normal uh, grafana page where you can add some data source right you just click on it you go to prometheus graphite or influx db uh, whichever data source you want to add it you can do it from here if you want you can click on learn more okay and if you go to the your uh, teams dashboard right you have uh, other options over here so you can see prometheus setup and manage prometheus metrics right just click on details you can see it's give you uh, more information so using grafana with grafana cloud metrics right how you want to integrate your prometheus so uh, you know it talks about how you want to do it so you can see this url we have to use right the port we need to generate an api key and what we have to put it in the uh, prometheus.yml file so it gives a lot of uh, details so you need to go through it so i'm not uh, went in depth uh, on this uh, configuration of part but i just wanted to show you like uh, there is a real uh, easy way now you can create a grafana instance in the cloud which is completely free so you know you can use it for all your learnings you can integrate with your data sources as, and then you can start uh, playing with that if you go to the billing side and manage subscription you can see uh, different uh, options you have right so now currently we are in the free uh, zero dollar version so you can see uh, what are the features you get three users 10 dashboard 100 alerts right uh, 10,000 series 14 days retention uh, 50 GB right so uh, community support and all those things now if you want to go for an uh, pro version you have uh, two options so the advanced I think you need to contact them and they will give you the price for it but if you see the pro version then uh, you have the $49 per month okay plus metered usage so there you can read through it like you know what are the features from it so 10 users by default and if you want more users it's uh, $5 per month right dashboards and alerts and everything is uh, unlimited you also have other options like LDAP uh, reporting custom domain uh, a lot of features so you just read through it okay so you can decide uh, which one you want to go or you can just use the free version for your uh, purpose okay so that's all I wanted to show uh, in this tutorial so this is a quick uh, informative tutorial so I hope it will be useful for you so thank you all for watching so uh, i would again uh, request you like if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly subscribe like this video share and comment